Welcome back to another Source SDK 101 video tutorial. Today we're going to learn about vertices, the vertex tool, and the clipping tool. So we have the advanced brush, the cylinder that we created in the last tutorial, and today we're going to mess with the vertices of it. So as I told you, these are all vertices. So if you want to change around the the way it looks a lot, like the vertices, you can dramatically change the shape of the object. So what you're going to want to do is go down here to your vertex manipulation tool. Click it, select it, and you're going to get a ton of these little squares. Now, you don't want the yellow ones. The yellow ones, I mean, you can use them, but they're really not that important. So what you're want going to want to do is you're going to you're going to click the vertex manipulation tool again until you get the white ones. Now, what you can do, if, you, if I turn down my grid size, you can take, you hold down these, and you can change the shape of the object. Now, no changes are saved until you go back to your select tool. So now I can just flatten this out to make it a little more... I don't know, just like a different object. You can dramatically change your objects this way. And see, as you can see now, I now have... Oops, it's a little messed up. Sometimes the textures can get a little screwed up with this, but you can see I have like a, a key keyhole kind of shape thing or something. But it looks a lot different than it did before. Now that we did this with vertex manipulation, so you can make a variety of different objects, but you don't want to go too crazy because this is even more taxing on the on your uh, computer, your system, with when you do something like this. It's a lot more heavier on the system. So now I'm going to teach you the clipping tool. So we're going to create an object. I'm just going to create a small little block down here and now we want to change this but there's not that many vertices we want to change it a little differently this time so now what we're going to do is we're going to take our clipping tool and we're going to cut it now you can see the part that um, is white is the part that's going to stay so if we hit enter only that part will be left but now we take the clipping tool again and, oops, um, take the clipping tool and we can click the clipping tool over again until we get what we want selected. So now it would just be this bottom half. And if we get both sides white, it will cut through there and it will make two different objects. So you can do this for a lot of different things. There's you know, tons of things you can make. So now I have all these objects. I can take pieces off and you can make walls look, you know, more destroyed or something you can you can do a whole ton of things with the clipping tool so it's a very powerful tool you just you want to use it correctly like that you don't want to end up with something that's bad or I don't know but be careful when using the vertex and the clipping tool they're very powerful and if they're misused it could completely destroy your map so thanks for watching stay tuned for the next tutorial on the no draw texture and don't forget to subscribe.